So my friends, good morning to all of you again. My name is Ruth and my boss is Norma. Normita. Take a look. So friends, on today's tour, we will be learning about the civilization called the Mayans. Nowadays, this part of Mexico is a busy garden of factories. Our main industry, the most important part of the economy, is tourism. And of course, people that live in small communities, they only produce like for their local consumption for their families. But they do all kinds of arts and crafts, beautiful things that you will be able to see. If any of you see something you like, you go for it. Diana. Yeah. Look at me. We are at the seventh wonder of the world. I love how we have both using our cameras to look at each other. And how do you feel about this? Oh, well, well. It's about seeing a wonder of the world. Is this is this your first one? Mm -hmm. What does it feel like? And honestly underwhelming. <laughs> wow. This, this people spent time. <laughs> This is another one of the buildings. Oh, that's so cool. Can I try it? Yes, okay, Carlton. Try it, try it. How do you do it? Yeah, okay. Close the mouth. With your hand. Can you blow the phone? So behind us is, is it just this one, the pyramid? No, I think the whole compound is. This is the calendar pyramid. This is the calendar pyramid. It was built by the Mayan people. Mm -hmm. And the information was passed down from generation to generation. And those people are clapping because of the echo. I don't think that explains anything. That explains <laughs> zero. Do you know what it does? So the buildings are designed with acoustics in mind. Hold on, Calton. Wow. When you are at the very top of the pyramid, your voice echoes louder because it bounces off the shop. Those are the way the buildings are designed. Everything echoes a lot louder. And because of that, when we are down here and we clap, it also echoes at the top. Ah. One eye, one animal? Yeah, it's similar than the eye, A, 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 the pupils. There was a time in the 1920s when the Peabody Museum came along, the Mexican government started doing some research. And what they had to do first is chop away all the trees that were growing on top of the buildings or through the buildings. So that's when archaeologists realized that all of the structures that we see here are not hollow. But you pile up rock, you pile up rock, you pile up rock. What you do is you take this rock and make it powder. Mix it with sand and water and voila, you get concrete. So that's how you stick the stones together, okay? Look at how pretty the stones on the outside are. They look like little Lego blocks, like little sparks. At this point, archaeologists were still kind of wondering, could there be like a hidden treasure inside the temple? They found that there is a smaller pyramid inside of the one we're looking at now. Almost free my sister. Happy hour prices. Oh, it's pretty. Can you ask how much this is for sure? We are on our way to Asinote, which we've already been to. So now we're walking down the stairs so we can go down there. I don't have my camera, so I'm using my phone. The vlog life. Because pictures already didn't happen. <laughs> In 50 years, how are you gonna convince us you went to see Asinote? Okay, so this is Asinote. Mm -hmm. How was your first experience? 
I like something on top too. And it's super cold. It's so uh, the water is cold. I guess it's because it's just like been here overnight and stuff. So it's like cool down and never cool down. And the sun is not there anymore. Ooh, there's a lot of shadows. This is what it looks like. The sun is on that side though. Yeah. Please come and visit Tenosha when you're here. Carlton is about to dive. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Now we're on our way back. Yeah. You did so like without thinking. I said, wow, very proud. You did well. No, I kind of wish I got some time. Wait, you said you had done it before. Like, no, no. Yeah, I've done it before. I'm here. Arriba. Arriba. Abajo. Ascento. No brakes. Wow. Why don't I have that one? Okay. Are you ready? 